Okay, it is now 10.48 in the morning. I'm getting up, getting ready to catch a cab on my way to work. As you can see, I just paid $20 for a babysitter for the night. Hi. Hi, how are you? I'm fine. I'm sorry. I didn't know you were out here for me. Alrighty, we're going to 1158 East Dundee Road. Okay, can you guide me? Yes, I can. Okay, because I'm not from this area. No problem, no okay. problem. Uh, it's Arlington Heights. Right? Uh no, it's actually gonna be uh it's actually gonna be the corner town of Palatine. But they border. Them, yeah, right? they're okay. right next to each other. It's means like have to no go. problem. Okay. All right. I'm just making a video, so if you hear me talking, it's I'm not no talking problem. to myself. <laughs> I you know pretend like I don't think it's an English either. Okay. You know, and plus blind. <laughs> okay, we're going. We're gonna make a left right out of here, and when you get to the stop sign, you're gonna make another right. Oh, we're going. Mm-hmm. Okay. Alrighty. Now, as you guys can see, I'm in the cab on my way driving to work. Remember, it is 10:49 in the morning. I'll be punching in within the next 10 minutes. And just to keep you in mind, I have two kids. So one of those kids, um, which is a small baby, seven months old, I just had to pay someone $20 to watch him for me while I go to work. Keep in mind, that's $20. Now I'm in a cab on my way to work. At Wilkie Road, you're gonna make another, uh, make another right. Mm -hmm. Now I am going to pay for a cab as well, and not only to work, but I'll be paying for one on my way home from work, um, which will be at 10 p.m. tonight. So I'm working an 11 hour shift uh, from 11 a.m. to 10 p.m. today. That's one day. And my uh, pay is $10 an hour, so we'll see. Uh, 10 times 11. You guys do the math. That's only $110. Yeah. Okay. Now, you guys just think for a second. I spend more money going to work in one day. In one day, I spend more money going to work than I do at home on my laptop working with MCA now the only reason why I wanted to record this video is so you guys could see that just like you I have a job you know and no it's not exciting it is a beautiful Saturday and I am about to spend my entire Saturday inside of a restaurant as you see my uniform I am about to spend an entire day inside of a restaurant I won't be able to come outside and enjoy at Dundee you're gonna make another right I won't be able to come outside, enjoy this weather. I mean, I, today was a beautiful day. I wanted to come outside, pass out flyers. As you guys can see, I have my flyers for business. I was ready to go. Um, instead, what I'm going to do is sit them on the counter at my work. And uh, my boss asked her if it's okay. If people collect my um, flyers if they're interested. If not, you know, I'll take them home at the end of the night and then, you know, pass them out. But um, this was just to let you guys see. If you really think about it on average, after you pay for transportation to get yourself to and from work, okay, after you realize what you're going to work for, I am going to work for a little pay, a lot of work for a little pay, okay? I'm a manager, which means I'm going to be overworked because not only do I have to be in charge of all of the paperwork and all of the customers and the customer complaints and anything, even customer rewards, but at the same time, I have to be in charge of all of that you know money big responsibilities things that you know what if something comes up missing or anything i'm going to be reliable for that if i punch the clock late i am reliable for that so being on someone else's time is not an ideal that you want to have for the rest of your life motor club of america can do that for you it can change some things for you i know for me i don't want to be punching the clock for the rest of my life definitely not working at a restaurant when i have two children to pay their college. I have two children to pay daycare for. 
I have two children that I have to make sure we have a roof over our head. And if you really, really think about it, like I said, 10 times 11 minus taxes. For today, I am making less than what I would make with one referral from Motor Club of America. That is just some knowledge and some reality for you. Something that cost me $40 and I didn't pay $40 to become an associate. So let's just get your facts straight. I paid $40 for a membership, unlimited towing, roadside assistance, fuel delivery, Lockheed Smith. I paid for dental discounts, vision discounts, prescription discounts. That paid for travel discounts, lodging discounts. That paid for lawyer fees, bond certificates. If you guys don't get my drift by now, I want you to understand that I am not trying to say you have to become an associate and do what I do to get paid off of it. I am just saying look at the benefits and look at the opportunity that is being presented to you if you're watching this video. If not, maybe some people want to work right here where the green car is. You're going to make a right into the parking lot and the castle's there. I'm arriving at my castle. It is now 1054. And as you guys can see, it, it's not too thrilling. So I just wanted you guys to see uh, just a trip for me on my way to work. Yeah, you can stop here. This okay. is my work. Okay. <laughs> and hey, now you guys can see I have to pay for transportation, babysitter. Then I'm going to be at work. I'm reliable, responsible for everything here. And on top of that, I'm not even making more than I would with just one referral. Ouch. Alrighty, you guys. Have a good day. Bye.